we upload it to YouTube. Alright, here is a list of the winners and participants in this break. As you all know by now, everybody gets a copy of this in their packages. And the uh, winner of the Deep Pockets Awards and the Donald Trump Award, uh, the Deep Pockets Award being the person that spent the most money, and the Donald Trump Award for the person who owns the most teams is to, his only username is 29877. 29877 is his eBay ID. And here is all of the people involved. Let me get this on camera for uh, camera number two. All right. Well, let's show that that last auction has ended. And here you can see. Yeah, we're good. That the last auction ended on August 4th, 2012, at 18.57, and that is the Minnesota Wild. Right there. And that is in the crease to stay. And that is exactly what's there next to the Minnesota Wild logo. Uh, hold on one second there, turds. There you go. All right, let me just refocus the cameras now and get ready for the break part. Now, I got uh, one computer screen off to my right, and that's where I have the uh, blog TV screen, so I have to turn my head every once in a while to see if uh, you guys are asking any questions so I can answer them for you. So if I... Don't answer something that you might have typed in right away. It's probably because I just haven't turned my head yet. All right. We got the list of winners shown. The last auction has ended. And here we go. With the sealed eight box case of titanium. And we're going to open that up now. And I'm going to number the boxes 1 through 8. Um, again, there are no serial numbers listed in this uh, case break as it was in the last. Because the box was never opened to get the serial numbers off of. So there was nothing for me to list. But here we go as I take them out of the box. This is uh, break 32. Box number one. Break 32. Box number two. Thirty two. Number three. Thirty two. Number four. Number five, thirty two, number six, thirty two, number seven, and thirty two. Number 
right. Get our box out of the way. Uh, don't forget we got uh, new bonus awards for the break here. Uh, you're going to get bonus cards for the first uh, rookie hit, bonus cards for the first defenseman, forward, goaltender. If we pull out a coach-specific card, there's going to be bonus for that. And don't forget about the Gordie Howe hat trick. Uh, in the break, if anybody hits any combination of a jersey, auto, and a rookie card, um, that's a Gordie Howe hat trick to me, and uh, it's going to be bonus cards for that. So I got my checklist at the ready here to keep track of who's hitting what. And uh, just in case, in the event that somebody doesn't hit, nobody leaves my breaks without an auto, a rookie, or a jersey. So with that being said, that camera's good. This camera's good. All right. Good luck, people. Here we go with box number one. Here we go. Everything's still on camera. Yes. It's pack number one. Good luck, gentlemen and ladies. All right. Start out with a base card. Base. And we have a Zach Cassian New Wave Auto for the Buffalo Sabres. So the Sabres get marked down for an auto. That's one part of the Gordie Howe hat trick. You know that these aren't numbered. So we got a hit for Buffalo. The decoy card. And another base card. Pack number two. Flying scissors. Now, if you guys want to come back and uh, watch this video that I'm going to upload to YouTube with a break, um, it's a case break, and the files are usually between four and 600 megabytes, and it takes several hours for it to upload. So if you're looking for the video to rewatch it, that's cool, but uh, don't look for it until morning. Uh, give me enough time to get it all uploaded. It takes a long time. So here we go with pack number two. We'll start out with a base card. Another base. And for the Colorado Avalanche, we have a Ryan O'Reilly uh, Game Worn Gear Prime. Looks like a uh, nice two color there with the seam running across the middle. And this is number 5 of 50. 5 of 50 for the Avs. And I need to mark him down with a game used. Wiki, welcome back. Pack number three. And here we go with a base card. Another base. And for the Coyotes, Shane Doan, Game Worn Gear, Single Color Swatch for the Yotes. So the Yotes are on the board. And I'm going to mark down a jersey card for the Coyotes. And a base card. Pack number four. Is anybody getting excited about Ultimate coming out this upcoming week? Uh, I'm going to try a few boxes of that stuff to see how that stuff looks. Uh, pack number four starts out with a base card. Another base. And Lars Eller for the Montreal Canadiens. 
game worn gear single color so Montreal is on the board with a hit and a jersey card Ooh, that's lineman 1319 finish that pack out with a base and last pack for box number one Anyway, base card, a base, and here we have a hat tricks for the Philadelphia Flyers of Chris Pronger, Scott Hartnell, and uh, James Van Riemsdyk. And base card is getting away, and this is 33 of 199. 33 of 199 for the Flyers. So the Flyers get a game used hit. All right, and a base card. That's it for box number one. Moving right along into box number two, break 32. On camera, here we go with pack number one, box number two. And we have a Rick Nash base, a Gilna base, and for the Dallas Stars, a Tom Wandell and Philippe Larson. Dual game gear, number to 300. For the Dallas Stars. So Dallas gets marked down with a jersey. And that is Eye Skins. So, so far, all the hits have been to different teams. Knock on wood. Trend continues. Let's get everybody something. And we have a base card. Base. And Jimmy Howard for the Detroit Red Wings. Game worn gear. Single color swatch. Oh, Detroit. Red Wings, all right. Brandon, Brandon's on the board, and the streak continues. All the hits have been for different teams. Here we go with pack number three. We have a base card. Base. And for the Washington Capitals, Mike Green. Game gear. Single color swatch for the Washington Capitals. And a base card. Pack number four. Have a base. Base. And another Jimmy Howard. Something tells me this one's going to be a little bit better. Jimmy Howard for the Detroit Red Wings. And here we have a Game Worn Gear Autograph Prime. So two Jimmy Howard hits in a row. And the Red Wings were who again? Brandon? Yeah, Brandon, you're in the room. Congrats. Show it to the second camera here. And that bad boy is numbered 7 of 25. 
7 of 25. And he gets marked down for an auto. So he is two thirds of the way to the Gordy Howe hat trick for bonus cards. Not bad on one team. Congrats. All we need is a Detroit rookie card, and you hit the hat trick. Here we have a base, a base, and a Adam Henrique new wave autograph for the Devils. The Devils are on the board with an autograph. Hulu 04. Congrats. And decoy and base. All right. Nothing extremely spectacular so far out of two boxes. The Howard autograph was nice, but I'm hoping for bigger and better cards to come out of this case as we move on to box number three. Shift it around in here. They don't want to reveal their treasures within. Five packs, empty box. Move it on camera, and here we go with pack number one. Base card, a base card, and a game worn gear of Sergey Bobowski for the Philadelphia Flyers. Single color jersey. And let's see, the Flyers already hit a jersey, so they don't need that. I don't need that as far as the hat trick bonus cards, but I'm sure they're going to take the hit. I would. Base card. Base. And here we have a dual game worn gear of Kiprasov and Tuka Rask. Number to 300. And this will be a random because it is the Boston Bruins and Calgary Flames on the card. Let's see if I get that thing to focus one last time. Nope, don't want to focus for me. There we go. So we have our first random. And a base card. Pack number three. And a base. Base. An autograph of Robert Ortuzzo for the Pittsburgh Penguins. I think that's the first time I called the Penguins today. So we have an autograph for the Penguins. Do, 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 do. Yep. Okay. So Wiki's looking for, uh, let's see, what's Wiki looking for? Wiki's looking for a rookie card for the hat trick. Decoy and a base. Base card, base, and here for the uh, Rangers, a uh, Matt Zuccarello game worn gear, single color for the Rangers.
or will 19 joining on board with a hit. Last pack for box number three is going to be nice because that is not a decoy card. So we start out with a base. And here we have a Paul Postma rookie to his jersey number. 34 of 38, which is one to a case. So we got a hit for the Jets, which is turds. Congratulations, turds. And right behind him is a wicked awesome patch. Not only is it a shotgun hit. Let me show you your rookie card. Not only do you get the case hit turd, but the next card is BAM for the Winnipeg, uh, Winnipeg Jets. A double. And this is number 22 of 25 of Tobias Enstrom. And I see one, two, three, three different colors. One, two, three, four, five different breaks. That's a very nice patch card for you. So you got the case hit plus a gorgeous patch card there. I gotta mark you down for a rookie. And a jersey. So all you need is an autograph for the hat trick for yourself. So that box picked it up a little bit. We had the case hit, the rookie number to his jersey. And box number four in one second. Sorry, I had to have a sip of coffee. My throat was getting a little dry. So here we go with box number four. One, two, three, four, five. Empty box. Here we go with pack number one. Sorry about that. I guess I spoiled the surprise, huh? Something for the Buffalo Sabres there. Oh, and there's another rookie card. So let's start out with the base. And here is a rookie card of Brandon Saad for the Chicago Blackhawks and I believe this is his draft position this is numbered uh, to 43 this is number to his jersey also but this is that this is the regular thin card I don't know if his jersey number is 43 and his draft position was 33 uh, 43 also It's 36 out of 43, and that's his jersey number. But usually the case hits are the uh, are the thick cards. But regardless, for the Chicago Blackhawks, that's uh, 298.77. That hit's going out to you, and you're in for a rookie card hit for the Blackhawks. And right behind him for the Sabers, numbered. 15 of 25 for the Buffalo Sabres and this is uh, Cody Hodgson Cody Hodgson for the Buffalo Sabres now this gets two check marks one as an autograph and one as a jersey card so Buffalo is on the board with a nice sweet hit Find the Sabres. Who's got them Sabres? Vikings 50. Already has the auto jersey. He's looking for a rookie card. And we wind up with base. Yeah, that is confusing. 
to be drafted 43rd and then actually have two cards number two is Jersey but unfortunately that's not the that's not the real thick one here we go with pack number two uh, a base card a base and a Kari Lettinen game gear here for the Dallas Stars single color so Dallas with a uh, another hit I believe yep and a base card base card a base card and here we have another hat tricks this one's number to 199 also this is Curtis Joseph Grant Fear and uh, Jaguar number to 199 and it's going to be a random between the Toronto Maple Leafs and the Colorado Avalanche you see on the back of the card, Jaguar is identified as an avalanche. So when this card is random, I'm going to list the uh, three teams. It's going to be Toronto listed, Toronto listed a second time, and the avalanche listed once. And then it'll be random three times, and who's ever on top gets the card. So a second random here. And a base card. Pack number four. Third, I see you messaging messaging me right now, but uh, I'm gonna get through with this box and I'll see what uh, what it is. Got a base card, and here we have a parallel. Of Jonas the Monster Gustafson, number to 99 for Toronto. That's just a base parallel, but still nice for the Leafs. And behind him, we have a rookie dual signature of Brendan Smith. Sorry about the glare. And uh, Gustav Nyquist. And that is a dual auto for the Detroit Red Wings. And it's numbered 45 of 50. So we got a dually auto for the Red Wings. Brandon, another sweet hit for you, sir. The decoy and base. And the last pack for this box. Got a base card, base, and another Sergey Brabowski game worn gear. I had this happen one time before where I had four Brabowski game gears come out of a case. So another hit for Philadelphia. And a base card. Right, let's see what the uh, message is here. Turd, I, I don't know. I'd have to uh, work out. I'd have to weigh your package. Um, I can tell you that uh, the only way that I can uh, send other than regular to Canada is registered mail, and that is expensive. Uh, I believe the last time I sent a package out registered mail, it was like 14 or $15. So, but, uh, you know, if you want to uh, see about having that option done, uh, you know, we can talk about that after the break. You know, I can get a quote from the post office after your package is weighed. 
and go from there. But it's not cheap. I can tell you that. A two ounce package to ship to you uh, friends of mine over the border, just a two ounce package is $3.50. And a two ounce package is nothing but a single card in a top loader in a bubble envelope with postage sticker on it. And that's already two ounces. And that's $3.50. Here is box number five, but it's an option. I mean, if you want them expressed to you, that's cool. I got no problem with that. Uh, I'm just not going to pay the cost for it. Pack one, two, three, four, five. Here we go with pack number one. Oh, we got a base card. Base. A uh, Penguins hit of Jordan Stahl and Tyler Kennedy. Excuse me, this is a dual game gear. The 300. One blue, one white swatch. With the Pittsburgh Penguins. And a base card. Wiki had that last hit for the Penguins. He already hit a jersey with the uh already hit a jersey with the Avalanche. So we're still looking for a rookie card for him. Is wrapped pretty tight. Cards just don't want to come out. There we go. Hmm, we have a base card. Base. And for the Mighty Ducks of Anaheim, a Jonas Hiller game gear. That is a single color swatch. For the Ducks, the Ducks are on the board. And a base card. Okay. Moving along. Have a base card. Another. And for the Avalanche, a TJ uh, Galladary. Probably pronouncing that wrong. There is a single color game gear for the Avalanche. And a base card. Base. Base. And here for the Edmonton Oilers, we have an Alice Hemsky. And this one is a nice three color prime for the Edmonton Oilers. And that's number to 50. Last week, Edmonton, I believe, got shut out in. Uh, case of uh, titanium but not this week and the oiler score jersey base card and last pack for this box we have a base card base here we have another dual rookie signatures. Second one from this case. And this is going to the Dallas Stars of Thomas Vincour and uh, 
Colton, uh, not even going to give that last name a crack. Number to 50. So Dallas hits with a, a dual autograph. Stars. Iskins. And a decoy and a base. So we had a couple of nice prime jerseys. Uh, one nice patch. The rookie hit number to his jersey. And a couple of dual rookie autographs so far. Let's keep uh, keep going, get a little higher here. Box number six for this break. Empty box. And here we go with pack number one. And a base card. Base. Here we have a Nick Bonino for the Mighty Ducks of Anaheim. New Wave Autograph, not numbered, not focusing, there we go, for the Ducks, so the Ducks score an autograph, right. the decoy, and a base. Pack number two. And a base card. Base. And a James Neal game worn gear for the Pittsburgh Penguins. Three hits for the pens that I can recall, and a base card. Pack number three. Base card. Base. And a J. Bowmeister game gear for the Flames of Calgary. Single call. For the flames. And a base card. Base. Base and a game worn gear for the Senators of Milan Mahalik. Michael Mahalik. Single color for the Ottawa Senators. And a base card. Base, base, and here we have a rookie reserve, number to 100 of Adam and Rake for the New Jersey Devils, number to 100, so there's a nice hit for the Devils. Mm -hmm. 
Hulu. Hulu 04. Oh, base card finishes that out. <clears throat> Box number 7. Base card, another base card, and here we have for the Capitals uh, Michael Nevruth, Newverth. This is number to 25. It's got a patch, a standard piece of jersey, a prime piece of jersey with a seam over there, and a fight strap. Sorry about the glare. Number to 25 for the Capitals. That was a very nice hit for Washington. Oh, he's got the Capitals. 29,877. The person with only a number for a username. Pack number two, base, base, and a Justin DiMettedetto autograph for the New York Islanders. I will call the Islanders out. So we got an auto card for the Islanders. Decoy and base. And then also completes a hat trick. For 298.77, he is hit an auto, a rookie, and a jersey with the tools that he has. So he's going to be getting bonus cards for hitting the Gordie Howe hat trick. We have a base card, a base, and here we have a draft day autograph number to 99 of Ryan Johansson for the Columbus Blue Jackets. There we go. This is 84 of 99. So there's a nice hit for the jackets. Decoy and base. Base card. Base. A game year of Trevor Daly for the Dallas Stars. Single color swatch for Dallas. And a base card. We have a base card, a base card, and a Shane Doan game gear for the Coyotes. Single color for the Oats. And base card. Okay. Last box here for the normal break. And after this box is broken, I have to take a quick little break. I gotta run upstairs and go to the bathroom. 
I'm sure you guys are much happier now that you know that. Box number eight. That one can't get packed any tighter there. Let's hope we end with a monster hit there. Empty box. And that's number one. Have a base card, base, and a redemption. A draft day autographs <clears throat> card number nine of Tyler Sagan. Tyler Sagan, I believe that's Pittsburgh. I can probably tell you a lot about the Blackhawks, but yeah, I believe it's for the Penguins. Anybody confirm that for me? Seeing how I don't know every player in the league, I believe Sagan is a a Penguin, or was it Boston? Wait a minute, he might have been Boston. Don't worry, I'm not going to send the wrong card out. Yeah, I thought Boston. I don't know why I was thinking Pittsburgh. Now that I remember, I got a auto rookie card of his, and he is a Bruin. We have a base card there. Another base. And an Alex Urbom. U-R-B-O-M. For the New Jersey Devils. New Wave Autograph. So, another hit for the Devils. I know they've had a couple of hits here so far. We've got the auto. And decoy. And base. Pack. Have a base card, base, and for the Boston Bruins, a Tim Thomas game gear, single color swatch for the Bruins. Don't mind me, I mumble to myself while I try and keep track of things. I can already see one thing I forgot to keep track of. But that's why we have recorded video. We have a base card. Here we have a rookie for the stars of, or uh, rookie parallel of Thomas Vancouver, number 100 for the Dallas Stars. Oop, I don't know if you guys saw a peek. There's a shotgun hit. So Vancouver for the Stars, number to 100. And you guys can take a look at that card there. As I mark down the Dallas Stars with a rookie card. And they also have a hat trick. So Iskins has hit a auto rookie and a jersey from the break. So he'll be getting bonus cards for hitting the hat trick. And as you guys were waiting for me, you already saw this. It's going to be... Dustin Brown for the LA Kings. And this one is numbered 33 of 50. 33 of 50 of the focuses. I don't look like it's going to cooperate with me, but it is numbered to 50 for the LA Kings. That was a nice hit there for the Kings. Got a jersey, got an auto there, and a base. And we come down to the last pack of the break. I'm hoping this is something really nice because it is packed tight. If it was any tighter, I think the packaging would rip. Mm. 
we have a base card. We have a Jeff Skinner uh, base parallel to 99 for the Carolina Hurricanes. Oh, wait a minute. I, there was a mistake here with this thing before. I remember um, this coming up in a break somewhere before. This card is an error card. So they have the Hurricanes and then they have the Ottawa Ottawa Senators logo as you can see on top of the card right there so this is going to go to um, who Jeff Skinner plays for I know he hasn't been traded yet in his career <coughs> behind him we have a titanium reserve autograph of Nazim Kadri for the Toronto Maple Leafs. And these titanium reserves are numbered. And it looks like that's going to be the last hit for the case here. And that was going out to the leaps. You said the autograph. We the decoy. And we end with a base card. Okay. All right. Uh, we got a couple of randoms to do. Uh, guys, give me, a, give me two quick minutes and we run upstairs real quick. We'll knock that out, and then we'll get to trivia, and uh, deal or no deal. All right, guys, thanks for uh, waiting. All right, two randoms to do. Uh, the first one is going to be for the dual gaming gear, number 300 of uh, Kipper and Rask. And that will be between the Flames and Bruins. So the flames will be listed first with the Bruins underneath. So let me get up blog TV, I mean, uh, random. Random.org. Let's get this camera up so we can all see it. I'm going to put this one too. Should be good. All right, list randomizer. And like I say, we list the flames first. Oh, 
planes and uh, ruin. Well, you can see that they're listed there. Flames and Bruins. All right. I'm going to randomize it three times. Here we go with number one. Bruins Flames. Number two. Flames Bruins. And the third and last time is Bruins Flames. And you can see that the list has been randomized three times. Go down here in the corner there. So this hit goes to Boston. All right. And one more for the uh, Joseph Fuhr and Jaguar. It's because they identify him as a leaf, a leaf, and an av. So that's why this car is going to have to be randomed off. So, go to a new randomizer. Leafs on top. Leafs again. And the avs on the bottom. It's the same procedure three times. Standing tall on top gets the card. Here we go with one. It is now the Leafs Avalanche Leafs. Number two, it is the Avalanche Leafs Leafs. And the third and last time is the Avalanche Leafs Leafs. And here you can see that it was random three times. So that hit goes to the abs. And that takes care of the randoms for the break. <coughs> okay. Now before we get started with the uh, trivia and deal or no deal, um... There were, uh, like I say, bonus awards for uh, certain certain things, and in the listing, it clearly showed what was going to be given away for the owner of the most teams, and for the Donald Trump Award for uh, that that was for the most teams, and uh, Deep Pockets Award for the most money spent. Um, that person happened to be the same for both, 298.77. So all the cards that you saw scanned into the listing are going out to you, sir, for uh, being the Deep Pockets winner and the Donald Trump winner. So these were the cards that you saw listed. Got a Heroes and Prospects autograph, a Choo Choo Game uh, jersey of Authentic Fabrics, uh, Frozen Fabrics, Brad Boys, Rudolph, Jersey, Authentic Fabrics, the McLeish, Significance Auto to 50, got a wire photo insert from, uh, or uh, I should say a, a high number card from the base set, got a Recky, Trilogy jersey going out to you. The Franz Nielsen Sweet Shot rookie jersey. Cam Fowler Rookie of the Year contenders from contenders. And the Thomas Vanek honorary swatches of the Buffalo Sabres. Those are all your cards, sir, along with any of the cards that you scored from the break. Thank you very much. Now, the other awards and bonus cards that I give out are going to be for the uh, Gordie Howe hat trick, 
for the first uh, rookie, first uh, defenseman, first forward, and first goalie hit. Now this is the sheet that I was using as I was doing the break to uh, jot down and X out teams as they scored an auto or rookie or a jersey. So there are a couple of people that are going to be getting bonus packs for the Gordie Howe hat trick. And that is Iskins for the Dallas Stars, who hit an auto rookie and a jersey in this break. And 298.77 with the teams that he purchased. He also hit an auto rookie and a jersey. Just one in any combination. So he's going to get bonus cards for the Gordie Howe hat trick. And that is it for those. Now, one thing I did not do that I should have been doing as this break was going on was mark down the first rookie, the first forward, first defenseman, first goalie card. And that you can clearly see I forgot to do. But with the power of recorded video, I'm going to go back and watch the recording and make sure that the first rookie card first forward card, first defenseman, first goalie. Um, all of those people for those teams also get bonus cards. Uh, I'm not going to take a guess and try and remember who was first. I don't want to make any mistakes. Uh, you guys are going to be able to see the video too once it's posted. So um, I'm going to have to go back and watch the video for that to make sure that the correct people get correct bonus cards. But believe me, they will be sent out. Ugh. <sighs>